today's little problem. I've put uh, it's either an AI or an AIS lens onto my Nikon D7100 and now I can't get it off and a few people I can see on forums have had the same problem and I thought what on earth am I going to do and if you so basically it's at f16 at the moment and I just cannot get it off and if I rotate it around to f1.4 in fact it won't go to f1.4 it'll go to f2 and press the release it still won't go now I'm not going to force it but what I can see is that it's hitting this little tab there so I'm going to see if I can uh, remove the um, the AI fingers that used to engage with the old ap aperture mechanism of a Nikon F and earlier style cameras and see if, if I can remove that little uh, set of fingers then I should be able to get the lens off. Now I just happen to have a Nikon F so I'll show you what I mean. So that's the little indexer that interfaces with the see how that locks in and that's how the aperture mechanism works on older Nikon cameras and by older I mean 1959 so first step always take the battery out before you do anything on a camera no power no shorts okay that's one side now you got to rotate it around there we go and now I can access the screw on the other side now they're not particularly tight Okay, press that in, voila, problem solved, that's how you get it off, and always, if you're using a manual lens, have your camera in manual mode, for goodness sake. So out of interest, you can tell there's no little pin notch uh, which would normally be round about there, so that means that this is a Nikon AI lens. And if I have a look at this little 51.4, you can see here that this is a Nikon AIS lens because it's got the pin notch uh, right where my fingernail is. So that's the difference.